Apple WWDC is always an exciting event for app developers and tech enthusiasts. And this year was no different. Here are some of the highlights from this year's conference. Apple announced a new programming language called Swift UI. This will make it easier for developers to create user interfaces for their apps. The company also announced a new app store for Mac called the Mac App Store. This will make it easier for users to find and install Mac apps. Apple also announced a new iCloud service, which will allow users to sync their data across devices. Finally, the company announced a new version of its operating system called Mac OS Mojave. This new OS will include a dark mode and new features for the Finder and Safari. The M1 chip in the MacBook Air, MacBook Pro, and Mac Mini was a huge surprise when it was announced last year. It completely changed how Apple computers are made, and it's been a huge success so far. But there's always room for improvement, and that's what Apple is doing with the M2 chip. The M2 is an updated version of the M1 chip that's faster and more powerful. It's also more energy efficient, so your MacBook Air will last even longer on a single charge. Apple says the M2 chip is up to 20% faster than the M1 chip, and it's also more powerful than Intel's best chips. Apple introduces iOS 16 with a customizable lock screen, updated notifications, and more. Apple has announced the next version of its mobile operating system, iOS 16. The update includes a number of new features and improvements, including a customizable lock screen, updated notifications, and more. Another big change in iOS 16 is the way notifications are handled. In the past, notifications would interrupt you and take over your whole screen. Now, notifications will appear in a small banner at the top of the screen, so you can see them without stopping what you're doing. iOS 16 also includes a number of other small improvements, such as an updated Maps app, a new Siri interface, and more. Apple's fitness app is coming to all iPhone users. Apple is bringing its fitness app to all iPhone users. Previously, it was only available to those who had an Apple Watch. Apple's new 13-inch MacBook Pro also comes with an M2. Like the new MacBook Air, the 13-inch MacBook Pro is also getting an M2 upgrade. It comes with up to 24 GB of RAM, up to 2 TB of storage, as well as up to 20 hours of battery life, and it still has a touch bar. The new 13-inch Pro will be available next month and is available to pre-order now, starting at $1,299. That's all for now. I hope you liked the video and make sure to subscribe the channel.